Um, well, it started with this pandemic, actually. I was going through my boxes of memories, and there's a whole lot of boxes of different things in my life. And I came across my album, which I produced, I think, back in 2005. Um, and I had, you know, favorite songs that I never really released and nobody really heard. I'd show snippets on my social media, but... I really was looking forward to that album. I think I was 21 when I did that. And that was such a good time in my life. And I thought that, you know, um, I want to release it. I want to share it. Uh, and uh, voila lang, because everybody's at home and music is also such a, you know, big, you know, um, relaxation. Like it's good to listen to music. I just wanted to add a song to their playlist. Well, 2005. <laughs> <laughs> If you could just put it there. <laughs> <laughs> so I don't really have any inspiration about it now. But mm -hmm. of course, during the time, it was a different life. It was a different, it was like three lifetimes ago. So um, I don't exactly remember how it felt. But I can kind of still visualize the life that I had. And um, that was my time when I was coming of age. I turned 21. I um, left my management team. I was independent financially from my family. I tried to handle my own money. Um, I fell in love. I, I made myself my own album thinking I can do it on my own. But again, I'm glad that I did that because there's always a reason for everything. So that was a really, that was a really, you know, memorable time for me. And I really, I really, I'm so happy that I'm going to be able to release the song because it doesn't sound like 2005. It sounds now. It's not dated. So yeah, chill, very breezy. Mm -hmm. Something that you can keep on while you paint or relax when you're having wine. I'm not a I'm not a threat to anyone. Like really, honestly, I've been working for so long. I've gone through the ups and downs of my career. I feel like I'm just there. Like you know, this is just me. Um, so I don't really. I'm not here to compete, or I don't even think it's gonna be number one. Like you know, it's just I just like to put things out there to cater to people that want it, to cater to people that want to be happy or to cater to people that are curious. Um, and, you know, it may not be for everyone, but I'm actually okay because I was never an everyone type of girl. I don't, I don't know. My type of flavor is just probably for certain people. But, um, if it, but if by chance that you like it, then that's beautiful. It had um, about five songs, the album. Um, but I think I'm probably just going to release two or three. Depends or four. I don't know. It depends. Because it's not really super career. It's just, you know, something that... But it's like a flavor of the month type of thing. So I don't... You know, I'm not really a singer-singer. Uh, maybe I was when I was 19. But, you know, it's just a... It's just a mood, siguro. And sometimes the mood just lasts for a couple of minutes. And then we can shift to the next. So okay lang. Ayoko naman din na super... I don't want to market myself that I'm a singer-singer, you know? I just want to keep sharing little sparkles of my happiness from time to time.